you opened up IQ and you noticed that your lighting core and your lighting node pro or your lighting node core or your commander core, all those different cores that you had connected to your PC are mysteriously gone. But weirdly enough, and oddly enough, it's here in the software updates. So where could they possibly be? I'm gonna show you a really easy fix in order to fix this. This may sound ridiculous, but one of the things that you can look for is something like rebooting your PC. Now I'm not talking about just going to hit the Windows button and clicking restart, but actually shut off your PC completely. Sometimes the system can glitch out. And then once you do a full restart of the PC, a full shutdown and reboot of your PC, then your devices can just appear but that doesn't resolve your issue we're going to proceed to the next step here we want to make sure to have a secure connection to the lighting node core or the commander core because sometimes the usb connection might not be completely in and what can happen is that your pc can recognize the device but you will be unable to control the device so please make sure that all your USBs are connected properly to your Lightning Node Core or your Lightning Node Pro or your Commander Core. Now, another issue could be that you could be using the cable that they provided you, which is a two-in-one splitter for a USB device. Now, you may want to eliminate that because sometimes they could actually be faulty. Now, if you want to check the resistance, to see if there's any breakage in the wire, you can just connect the USB port to directly to your motherboard. And more than likely that could even resolve your issue there. The next thing to look for is you want to make sure to have SATA power. Your PC may recognize the Lightning Node Core or Commander Core or whichever device that you have that is from Corsair in your PC, make sure that the SATA connection is connected and you want it to have it directly connected to your power supply. Otherwise, you can run into the same issue to where it disappears or you might not even have a chance to really control your devices. Now we're sure we have all the physical connections and you're still having the same issue. So we're gonna go and re-download IQ, but make sure to select your correct language for your PC, otherwise it's gonna give you trouble, and click repair the app. Don't click start as new because we're not really trying to start fresh because we know how much of a pain that is, especially if you have a ton of customizations done onto IQ. You can always save it, but we are for now going to repair the IQ file because more than likely it is corrupted such as I have IQ between multiple PCs so it may detect different devices and may be looking for certain devices that are not specifically on this PC but this will also fix other problems such as those who are having problems with IQ recognizing their file in the first place or recognizing their commander core or the lighting node core or whichever type of lighting controller that you have, this will help IQ recognize those devices. Once IQ is finished to repair, please restart your PC because this is where you're gonna get results. Don't restart later, let's restart it now because you know how finicky IQ can really get. And we will see what we would get back. And here we are. Now everything appears. Now I have my Lightning Node Core and my Lighting Node Pro. So far, the problem seems to be okay. Now, you may have missing devices out of your Lightning Node Pro, so you may have to reset them because technically IQ more than likely forgot those devices. Make sure you select the correct number of fans or the amount of lighting channels that you have connected to your lighting controllers Otherwise, it's just going to give you this weird one LED light. Just test them out. Make sure you click any of these options here, any of these presets. And more than likely, this will resolve the issue when it comes to IQ. Now, if you're still receiving issues or any other issues persist, please feel free to let me know in the comments down below. But make sure you give it a full run and test and make sure to update all your devices that is connected to your PC. Otherwise, you don't want to run into other future issues. 
Come on, Corsair. Where's IQ6 already? Well, anyway, fam, fam, guys, I hope you found this content very useful. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you know anybody else who is struggling with IQ, make sure you share this video with them. And also, if not part of the big one of fam, fam, make sure you go down and hit the subscribe button for more. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. And for all the newest updates, make sure you follow my X handle right here, as it is the same as my TikTok and IG as well. Famim, guys, what are your thoughts about IQ currently? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is Chris Mizo, signing out.